Hello, we hope you're enjoying Sport Relief. Welcome to a special round of Mock the Week for the evening. The category is Unlikely Things to Hear on a TV Charity Show. <laughs> Coming up is a short and rather harrowing film about hunger in the third world. So this is probably a good opportunity to nip out and make yourself a sandwich. <laughs> We've been digging a well because it's essential that these people have somewhere to throw coins and make a wish. <laughs> <laughs> of course, chronic diarrhea is one of the worst diseases that affects these children. Children like Jenny. Oh, for God's sake! Don't, <laughs> don't <be> shoes! <laughs> I'm, I'm here. Uh, uh, I'm here with David Wallings. <laughs> 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 Just swam the river Ganges. Oh, 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 don't touch me, don't touch me. Please give generously, otherwise I'm gonna poke Pudsey in his other eye. <laughs> we desperately need your money to help starving people. And now, in a slightly insensitive segue, let's have a look at some footage of people getting into baths of baked beans. <laughs> Of course, Britain is full of underprivileged children with no hope and nowhere to go. And the government doesn't have enough money to send them all to war. <laughs> we sent Chris Moyles to Africa. Unfortunately, he escaped and came back again. <laughs> Susan from Brentford uh, rang up to donate £20. Uh, Mike from Manchester uh, rang up to donate £30. And Barry from Glasgow rang up to order two Hawaiian pizzas with a Pepsi. <laughs> well, they ate everything we sent them last year. I know, all of it. So someone's gonna have to start buying them food all over again. <laughs> <laughs> that was the Saturdays. Up next, Dara O'Brien doing an impression of a doorbell. That should be good. <laughs> <laughs> Just £15 a week will pay for the drugs that'll help me stop thinking about poor people. <laughs> <laughs> we'll have a big round of applause for all the people who've been working all night here. None of us are getting paid. None of us are getting paid? Forget it. I'm sorry. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> this is a soup kitchen, and the conditions are appalling. There's no gazpacho, no vichyssoise. <laughs> And no one's even heard of crab beast, even as an amuse bouche. <laughs> <laughs> Big thanks to Alex Ferguson for his massive support for Red Nose Day. He <laughs> hasn't taken his off for 69 years. <laughs> the money we're trying to raise here is to help people whose lives have been destroyed by Justin Lee Collins. <laughs> Well, I was lying there in the bath of custard and I wasn't sure if I would be able to go on. But then I remembered, I've got a lovely apple crumble in the oven. <laughs> <laughs> the tragedy is this blindness is caused by ignorance. With your help, we can stop these people masturbating. <laughs> Everything we raise today will go to charity. A lap dancer who's 19 and I'm particularly fond of. <laughs> Tonight, we're raising money for Dara O'Brien. <laughs> we work so he doesn't have to. <laughs> So, from unlikely things you hear on a TV charity show to the most important thing you'll hear tonight, how you can donate. Please call 03457 910 910 or go online at bbc.co.uk forward slash sportrelief. Your money really can make a difference. You've been watching Mock the Week for Sport Relief. Thank you and good night.